In this video tutorial, you will learn how to save images for web and devices in Adobe Photoshop CS6. If you are saving a picture intended to be put on the web, it is recommended that you use the Save for Web and Devices command because it provides a good trade-off between file size and image quality, resulting in faster loading web pages. You will start off by opening an image by clicking File on the top left corner. You will navigate down to Open and select the image of your choice. Once you have selected your image, click on Open. Once you have made all the adjustments to your image and saved a copy of your Photoshop file with a .psd extension, then you may save your file to make it ready to use on the web and other devices. Click on File and then navigate down to Save for Web and Devices. In this window, you can choose to view the original photo, the optimized photo, or you can also choose to compare two or four versions of this photo side by side. For this example, we will go over the two up view. In the two up view, click on the version in which you want to edit. If you want to compare your edited image to the original, single click the bottom image to edit. On the right side of the window, select the format drop down menu and choose the format you want your image in. You can choose from JPEG, GIF, PNG, and WBMP. Depending on which format you use, there are different adjustments you can make ranging from the amount of colors in the photo, dither, quality, blur, and others. If you are unfamiliar with these settings, there are 10 presets you can choose from. Notice as you adjust the settings or choose from different presets, there will be slightly noticeable differences in the file size. The goal is to find a good medium between the image quality and the file size. As you lower the quality, the image may lose some clarity, but the file size will decrease. You may also configure the image size by decreasing the percentage of the original image. You may also manually enter the width and height. The link button allows you to toggle retaining the image proportions. If you wish to view your image in a web browser prior to saving, select the image you wish to view, click on preview, and your image will load in a web browser. Once you are satisfied with your image, click on Save, name your image, and click Save once again. Your image is now ready to be put on the web. For more help regarding the process of saving images for web or any other help with Adobe Photoshop, click on Help and navigate down to Photoshop Help and you will be directed to Adobe's website filled with helpful tutorials. If you have questions about these instructions or need additional help, contact the St. Edwards University Instructional Technology Training Staff by email at training at stedwards.edu.